A land fight is on in Orange Park. It concerns a large development that's being considered on Kingsley Avenue called the Kingsley Plaza. If it's approved, it's slated for the site of the old Orange Park Performing Arts Academy. Supporters are saying the developer would invest more than $70 million into the town, while at the same time, a petition is circulating to stop the development. This is the site in question. Some call it an eyesore, the old Orange Park Performing Arts Academy, which was forced to close last year. Now, orange signs sit in front of the property that shows it's up to be rezoned and possibly developed into Kingsley Plaza with apartments, shops, and possibly a parking garage. I think that there's going to be a traffic jam, people getting in there, that many people living there and coming out. This is not welcome news to residents like Paul Sharp, who's lived here 40 years. He joins a vocal opposition who sounded off in the News for Clay County Facebook group on this issue with comments like, I'm angry, there's not enough space. Those poor homes. I live close by and I'm dreading it being so close. There's also a petition opposing the development with more than 500 signatures so far. But I talked to new mayor, Alan Watt, who says there is a lot of misinformation circulating. The project is taking a derelict piece of land that's been an eyesore for years and converting it into a multi or mixed use uh, a mixed use project. Mayor Watt says he would like to see some tweaks to the proposal but it could be critical for the growing town. Change is coming, development is coming uh, it's hard do I think I think generally yes I'm in uh, we actually have somebody, for the first time in history, a major developer that's willing to come in and invest $74 million in the town. It's unclear what the town council will do. The town's planning and zoning board unanimously rejected the proposal, but that doesn't mean the town council will. Mayor Watt says it will be discussed and possibly voted on at their next meeting on June 2nd.